gorgeous gorgeous girls welcome back to a new video if it is your first time here on my channel my name is Shamir welcome today is Monday so happy Monday we're actually about to Babe, mama's talking. I'm actually about to head out right now. I need to run some errands. Most definitely have to go to Target because I'm all out of laundry detergent, bleach, uh, fabric sheets, and I have so much laundry to do. If you guys need a reason, another reason to not have kids, I'm gonna tell you now. Well, all this this is the reason why but also because I don't know how like this is I've never I've never gone through laundry detergent as fast as I do now I'm literally doing laundry like twice a week and I don't I don't know how he goes through all of these clothes to say tell them okay um, but yeah, so we're gonna for sure go to Target and we also need to go to the supermarket to <laughs> pick up some groceries. Um, I was gonna order, you know, just do Amazon Fresh, but since I'm already gonna be out, I'll just stop by Ralph's and pick up some groceries and maybe also Trader Joe's, depending on how Maddox feels, cause he hasn't had his nap yet. So depending on how he feels, we'll try and do all of that. way longer than what I wanted to be, but I did end up going to a few different stores. Um, I, I actually went to World Market for the first time, and I don't know why I haven't been there when there's one um, next to like the Ross that I go to in the Trader, my Trader Joe's. It's right there and I just never go to it, but I actually went in there today. And at first I didn't think I was gonna find anything, but before I left out, I found a couple pieces and I'm really happy about, and I wish I would've went in there from the start because I might like these better than some things that I, that I already bought recently. But I, wait, wait, that's from the candle, I have to just wrap that off. But I came across these gold candle holders. I got two of them, one in, in the shorter size and one in the taller size. Um, the shorter one was $17.99 and then the taller one was $21.99. These are so cute. I'm thinking about switching these out for the candle holders that I just put on my coffee table, the black ones um, that I spray painted. So I also got two of the um, pillar candles to go with these. And from there, their pillar candles are $6.99. I don't remember how much the ones from Walmart was but i think it's around the same price if i'm not mistaken so yeah i got that from world market they had tons of other things that were like really nice but nothing that i really needed and then from walmart i did end up getting like some of my groceries because i didn't go to ralph's or trader joe's didn't feel like doing that today but i also got like some of my cleaning supplies um laundry detergent bleach i got this bucket because i picked up a mop um, I usually just use my Swiffer and then I'll put like bleach and other stuff on the floor when I use a Swiffer, um, mainly because I don't have space to store a mop in a bucket, but this, I'm just going to have to make it work because I really needed a, a mop. Oh, I picked up more things for his birthday party. So they had like these mini things of Play-Doh in like all different colors. So I did end up getting 13 of these for his, uh, the gift bags for his birthday party. I had um these bubble sticks so i'm gonna put these in his gift bags as well um and these are actually very reasonable it says six for the price of four so i got um i got two packs of these so walmart also had these little these cute little saucers i thought these were the cutest things ever these were like no more than two dollars and you guys remember those um little onesie sets that i bought maddox and last week's vlog, I bought him two that time, so then I just picked up the other two colors that they have. So I got him this one in this color. I got this one in a 24 month, and then this one in an 18 month. So now he has two of them in 18 months and two of them in 14 months. You guys, go and get these sets. They also have them in colors for girls, but I feel like the quality is just so good for it to be from Walmart. Yesterday, Maddox actually had 
his doctor's appointment so i was pretty much we were pretty much busy with that type of stuff all day um so i didn't really are you gonna stand up no you're not you're just using me um so i didn't really have time to like log um because i was just because we were just taking care of that stuff and he actually got two shots yesterday so i didn't i was just giving him all my attention because um he didn't really he actually didn't really cry he cried as soon as he got the shot but after that he stopped but of course like his legs were still kind of bothering him throughout the day so i just really didn't feel like vlogging yesterday I was just tending to him but right now we're actually about to meet up with my mom she wants to go to um she needs to go to the mall and i'm hoping that h&m home still has those pillowcases that i bought um that i bought last week i'm hoping they still have those but like in that lighter color because i feel like i want to add big boy i feel like i want to add um two more pillows onto the couch but in like a lighter color in a lighter color so i'm hoping that they have those so i'm gonna go check there today and see if they have them and then also yeah so <laughs> we'll see you guys at the store hey you guys so it's the next day i feel like <laughs> i'm just like i don't know i feel like a, i'm not a terrible i'm not a terrible blogger but i feel like i just always have so much going on to where i'm just like so over the place and we all know this i don't know why i keep telling you guys this but it's just like i have to remind you guys so you just don't think i'm a terrible blogger but maddox actually left with my mom last night because they were going to a birthday party today so he left with her but you guys know when maddox isn't here i try and like do as much as i can in one day so that's why i haven't been vlogging i actually just finished filming one video and i wanted to film another one which was going to be um what i eat in a day to gain weight i took those melatonin gummies that i showed you guys um last week I took them again because I took them last week, but the sleep wasn't all that good. But I think that's simply because I still had a lot of stuff to do and I still woke up early in the morning. But I took those last night around midnight, I want to say I went to bed. No, it was after midnight. It was like 3 a.m. when I went to bed. But I took those gummies. Those things knocked me right on out. I was out. I didn't wake up today until about 3 p.m. That's why I started filming so late because I woke up looked at my phone to see if Maddox called me and then I went back to sleep and I woke up at, at about 3 p.m. I was just like whoa and it was some good sleep I didn't even wake up I didn't even wake up throughout the night to pump and I usually wake up to pump I didn't care I slept like it was the best sleep I've had in so long and I just wish I could get more sleep like that but I know it's not possible right now but I really wish it was so yeah, I'm just uploading that video to my computer right now that I um, just recorded. I'm gonna start editing it tonight as well because Maddox is actually coming back home tonight. I'm just gonna try and get that edited before he gets home because it's not gonna take any time because it's just a sit down talk video. I don't know why the kitchen has like the best lighting. That makes no sense. Why would a kitchen have the best lighting? So I did go to the mall yesterday with my mom, but it wasn't like much to show you guys. I'm like, I always show you guys when I go to the mall. So like, how many times do you possibly want to see me go to the mall? Um, when you guys know, I'm going to just show you what I bought when I get home. But so actually yesterday I had got in a Amazon package. I had ordered these dish soaps. They're matte black. It actually came with the labels to put on them. Can you guys see that? So one says dish soap and then the other one is the hand soap label um, to stick on the bottles, which it came with two of the glass bottles. So, oh, and then it came with two sets of the labels so you get like extra. So I'm gonna put those on here and then, these are so cute, they're gonna look so cute here in the um, kitchen. We did stop by Zara and I didn't really pick up anything because I didn't really see anything and I don't need anything. We're gonna just say that I don't need anything. But I finally gave in and I got the Ebony Woods perfume. So when the girls were like all hype about Ebony Woods, I never smelled it because it was just like never in the store. But then I smelled it and it's definitely a Shamir scent. Like my mom smelled it, she was like, she didn't like it, but she said it's 
it's my type of scent which it is and i was actually going to just get the small bottle because i'm like do i really need another bottle of perfume no i don't but did i want it i did because i actually really do love the smell and it smells like something i already have what is it that it smells like i forgot what perfume i said it smells like that i have i figured it out last night but now i don't remember what it was um but the small little mini bottle small bottle was priced at 29.90 but then when i picked up the big bottle the big bottle was the same exact price so i was just like i'm going to just get the big bottle it made no sense to get the small one front of the box and then when you open it it looks like that and that's the perfume it's gonna smell so good at nighttime and when it's cold outside like i was trying to sell my mom on it and tell her like girl it's gonna smell so good when it's cold and crisp and the air is just so crisp she was like no it stinks i did stop by h&m home again i'm so happy there's h&m home near me because i would hate have to, to have to shop h&m on h&m home online um and I think this is the only H&M home I've seen in LA. Yeah, it is. But I told you guys I wanted to go back and get the same pillowcases, the same pillow covers I found in that black and charcoal color. I wanted to get it in a lighter color because I felt like the couch needed another lighter color pillow on there. So I did go ahead and just pick it up in this color. It's like a um, ivory color. Let me see if you guys... Okay, the camera's not really doing the color any um justice but you can see this is the velvet part and it's a lighter color and then this part here is like the darker color which i really like that it's kind of two-toned like the um the, the black and charcoal one is and i really like these cases because you guys know sometimes when you buy pillow covers the design will just be on the front and then the back of it would just be plain no this is double-sided so these were these were well worth it they were 17.90 17.99 the same as um the black ones and i just wish that these came in a bigger size but this i even checked online because i was like if i could find a bigger size on h&m home's website i'll just go ahead and order the bigger size but it didn't come in a bigger size so i just bought the same ones still need okay if you guys know if anywhere i can find a cute bowl decor bowl decorative type of type of bowl to put on the coffee table i can't find one i checked h&m home again and they they don't have any bowls like that so at this point i don't know but i am going to check crate and barrel probably tomorrow because i tried to go last night but they closed like at nine so i wasn't going to make it there in time but um i feel like that's my last hope at this point but i'm going to just um I feel like I've been talking a lot and I'm starving. I didn't really eat anything today because as soon as I woke up, I was like, let me get myself together and film this video before Maddox come home and then I won't have any time to film this video. So we got it done. I'm proud of myself. I did something. I, You guys, I feel like every vlog we go through this when Maddox isn't home and I'm like, I'm proud of myself. I filmed a video and then I don't film another video for like a whole month and a half. But that's because Maddox is always home and I don't have time to film any videos. Hey you guys, so it's the next day. Last night I had just chilled for a little bit while I was editing that video that I recorded and then a little bit later I had went and picked up Maddox so he is back home now. Um, today we were actually supposed to uh, meet up with a girlfriend for like lunch or whatever but I just, um, well we planned to do that. Me and her were speaking today and we plan to do that today. But then I was just like, you know what? Let's just do it next week while I need to be like a bit more prepared to like do things with Maddox. Because like bathing him and getting him dressed and everything. You guys know if you have a kid, that's a whole process on its own. Like that's a whole routine I have to, a whole other routine I have to um, do. And I need to go to Zara to pick up a couple things. And then I also want to stop by, I think I'm going to stop by Crate and Barrel first. Be careful, babe. Because I think they, I'm pretty sure they close um, early. So I'm going to stop by Crate and Barrel. Because I want to see if I can find a bowl there for my coffee table. Or something for the coffee table. And then, I think that's it. If I find something at Crate and Barrel, then I don't think I need to go anywhere else. But honestly, I don't feel like I should go to like Home Goods or um, Ross or TJ Maxx or, any, or anything like that. Because I'm always in those stores. I was just there. The day before yesterday um and i didn't find anything i went to burlington home goods 
Where else did I go? I went somewhere else. Oh, Target. Yeah, and I didn't find anything. So like, there's no reason for me to go there again. I know they always have different stuff, but I'm kind of getting burnt out on these stores because I'm just there so much. And I don't need to be spending that money anyways. So that's what we're gonna do. I was gonna say me and Max were still gonna go to eat, but I totally forgot that I said I was cooking today. And I honestly don't feel like cooking today now. I don't, um, but I need to because if I don't, some of my stuff is gonna go bad if I don't cook it. Okay, why are these so pretty? Thank you. <laughs> hey, you look so comfy. Right in style. <laughs> Are you funny with your right? Yeah, I'm actually looking for like a bowl to put on my coffee table. What type of bowl? Wood, like a, porcelain, stone? More like porcelain or stone. So a lot of those are going to be considered like serving dishes type? Really? Yeah. And I kind of figured that because everywhere I go, if I see anything that looks similar <laughs> to that, it will be like a serving dish. Got it. So a lot of our wood is going to be over here. There's going to be some. And this bowl actually looks perfect. I love this bowl, but I wish it was a lighter color. The serving utensils for the salad. This is nice. I think the one he's telling me about is the same as this one, but just in white. And if so, that's just way too big for my coffee table. Like this thing is huge. It's beautiful, but that's just way too big for my space. How old is your baby? He'll be one next month. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you say hi. <laughs> so I went to Crate and Barrel and they actually ended up having a bowl that I did like. Um, well, they had a smaller one that was like a clay color and then they had a huge one that was black and then they were supposed to have a white one that was like in between the size of the clay colored one and the black one. But they didn't, he said they had one in stock, but he couldn't find it in, in the store. So we, I just ordered it. Um, so I just ordered the white one and had it um, delivered to the store so that if I see it and I don't like it, I could just return it right then and there. Well, no, actually I would probably want to bring it home and see how it looks on the um, table. But he was trying to describe to me the size of it and he was showing me the pictures online, trying to compare it to um the size of the black one and the size of the clay color one shorter than the black one and it's a bit uh smaller in diameter and then that one compared to the white one compared to the clay color one when i first saw the clay color one i was like oh that's the perfect size but in reality that's just too small so i think the white one will actually be the perfect size because I didn't want anything too tall, but I did want it to have some sort of base on the bottom of the bowl. I did go ahead and just put those stickers on the soap dispensers that I showed you guys. And these things, they just look so good to me. I think these are like $30, $32 or something like that for the both of them on Amazon. I'll link them down below for you guys. If you guys watch my Zara try on haul, do you guys remember those abstract print jeans that I tried on? Which I think I said fit me perfectly. Well, I can no longer fit those jeans. I tried them on the other night. I can't even button the first button on the pants. Like it doesn't button whatsoever. So, but I really like them. Like, I haven't gotten to wear them because I cannot fit them now. <laughs> They're too small for me now. But they have some that was very similar. Like I thought they were the same exact jeans. The print is actually a tad bit different, but it's the same exact colors. And I think this one actually has, not eggs. Um, I think this one actually has a bit of a more relaxed fit um, pant leg. I think the other ones were very like straight leg as well, but they're a bit smaller. So I, I kind of do like these better and they fit a little bit longer as well. So I got these in a size eight because I couldn't fit that size six in the other ones anymore. But I kind of wanted a size 10 because I know I'm going to gain some more weight. And then I just needed some plain black joggers. So I got these from Zara as well in a size small. Knowing I can't fit a damn size small. Um, so I have to take these back. Like a thicker straw, not your average, just like round narrow straw. 
Um, so I got him this one and then I just got him this one here because it's Baby Shark and he loves Baby Shark. And this one also has a compartment to put his snacks in there. Yes, bad butt. You guys hear him saying bad butt? He's the bad butt baby, he knows it. Yes, you're the bad butt baby, Kinky. Don't smack me. See, you're the bad butt baby. Um, but that's all I picked up today. What you want? You want a snack? Okay, I'll make you a snack. But I'm gonna um, get started on dinner. I just didn't even get food while we are out because I'm like, I need to cook anyways. So I'm gonna just get started on dinner and I'll see you guys in a bit. Your little syrup. And that new cup that I showed you guys, I bought him. He loves that cup. He actually drinks from it. He holds it by himself. So I'm so happy that was not a waste of money again. He has scrambled eggs, French toast, and I just sliced the French toast into um, more narrow pieces, and then I sliced his bananas into smaller chunks so that he can pick it up on his own. It's like he hasn't fed himself soft foods yet, so I don't know how well he's gonna do with that. But like anything like that, like more solids, he's pretty good with. But he loves eggs and he loves bananas, but he's just never eaten them on his own. Nature's spoon. Want my help, okay? You got it? Hey, 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 hey. I'm my help. Good job, boo boo. Silly boy. Maddox. Maddox, where are you going? You're leaving me? You have to come back over here. Come on. You having fun? Say, this is fun, mama. You having fun? Hey guys, so right now I'm actually doing my makeup. Guess who's actually going out tonight? And I'm sorry if it's kind of loud. I have the AC on because it's like extremely hot, but I just turned it off, so I'm just waiting for it to like turn off completely. But I'm getting ready to go out um, to a girlfriend's, uh, to dinner for a girlfriend. And it's supposed to start at eight, and right now it's 7.08, so clearly I'm running late. But she's always late to things, so like I feel like she's not even gonna be on time. Um, but I'm trying my hardest to like still be on time though. But like I had to go and drop off Maddox at my mom's house. Going there and coming back literally took like almost three, four hours. So, okay, the AC is turning off. 
um so that really put me behind and then also because um i haven't been sleeping so like i slept in, oh shit so i slept in um later than what i was supposed to because i haven't been getting any sleep at night so um yeah they're just like put a late start on my day but i'm just doing my makeup um i'm bronzing with the makeup by mario's soft scope bronzer and i don't know why i feel like my makeup's about to turn out shitty every time i have to like actually have somewhere to go i feel like my makeup looks shitty um but then when i have nowhere to go i feel like it looks totally fine but i'm gonna finish getting ready my camera's dying i need to charge my battery because i'm gonna take my camera with me tonight um so i'll probably pick you guys back up once i'm done with like my hair and my makeup all right you guys so i just finished getting ready um outfits casual but still kind of cute and i moved the mirror last night to this wall instead of this one here but i have on um black leggings from where are these from my outfit online i believe and i have on this black i mean this uh it's like a chocolate brown bodysuit. It kind of looks like the Wolfer bodysuit. It's a good dupe for the Wolfer bodysuit, actually. And then I have on this tan and brown bomber jacket from Shein. And then necklace is from H&M. Boots are from Ego Official. Then I'm carrying this uh, bronze, kind of this goldish bronze clutch that's also from she in i'm trying to hurry because it's already past 8 30 and yeah and also because my sister's there waiting for me too so yeah that's the outfit i really wanted to get a lot more dressier than this but since my hair isn't done i feel like it kind of just ruins a lot of outfits because it's not done yet but i made my hair appointment to get my hair done <laughs> so it'll be done soon but yeah that's the outfit and i bought these long stem flowers for the birthday girl they're so pretty like this is the most beautiful bouquet i've ever seen I'm outside in the I guess I'm just so used to not sleeping to where I just was not tired. So I was out all night. My body's just so out of it to where like, I'm just not tired because I just don't get sleep. And I'm actually about to head to my mom's house to um, get Maddox. I may not vlog again until Monday because I'm not doing anything this weekend. Um, if it's hot enough tomorrow though, I may take Maddox to the pool but that's about it i hope you guys did enjoy this vlog i honestly don't don't even remember what really happened in the beginning of the vlog like i just don't even remember those days but that's the end of this vlog um today i'm wearing let me show you guys what i have on today though okay i don't now that the mirror is on this side i'm not too sure if i like it because now i feel like it just looks super dark in here from this angle because the mirror was here before unless it's just not that bright outside because it's still pretty early i don't know it's just giving kind of dark vibes but i have on this all white two-piece set from um from shein as well i think that's what you guys the other night that i'm just going to do a shein haul but this thing the quality of this set is amazing like it's such good quality i'm going to order another one but in a size small 
um, and then does have the thumb holes and it zips here as well. And then I'm just wearing them with my all white blazers with the charms on there. I either got these from like Foot Locker or Foot Action or something like that. But yeah, that's the outfit of the day. If you're not subscribed to my channel yet and you did enjoy this vlog, please do me a favor and hit the subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next video.